Hey guys, this morning, kind of a complicated one, but I'm gonna take you this step by step. And if it doesn't make any sense, I promise it will after you read the article at WQAT.com. It's a lot to squeeze into a minute and 20 seconds, but we're gonna go for it. So this question comes in from Gene from Clinton. How do we have a low dew point but yet have high humidity at the same time? It's a great question. So when we talk about humidity, that number is based off of two things, the actual temperature of the air and the dew point temperature. So when both of those are the same, as in this example here, you have 100% relative humidity. The closer they are, the higher the humidity. However, you start to separate them, say for example here, 80 degree temperature of the air, but a 65 degree dew point, that drops it to 60% relative humidity, and you can see it gets even lower as the temperature goes higher and the dew point stays the same. So the relative humidity, it all depends on the temperature of the air as the dew point stays constant in this example here. Here's how it changes as we go throughout the day. So in the morning, the relative humidity is high. It begins to lower during the day because our temperature begins to increase. So that drier air comes in and then the opposite happens again as we head in towards the evening. So again, the humidity, it all depends on how close together the actual temperature of the air is and the dew point temperature. For example, right now we have high humidity because those two values are fairly close together. You can read more about this at WQAD.com. I promise it will make a boatload more sense here than it did just there. Head to there uh, a little bit before GMQC at 11 to check out the answer. We'll be right back after this.